The nine current wells at the Hickory site could produce about six million gallons of water a day. They're drilling additional wells for a potential total of nine million gallons daily. News Connection's Stephanie Garland has the story on the drilling slated for completion in January. At the Hickory Pipeline, contractors are drilling, tripping out a drill stem pipe for the well, and bringing more pipes to the project. What has to happen is this well has to be drilled to total depth with the pilot hole, and that has occurred. They are now in the process of bringing the hole out. It's all a part of developing the well. When the six new wells are completed, they'll be connected to the same 62-mile pipeline that connects the Hickory Aquifer to the new St. Angelo Water Treatment Plant that the nine existing wells are already connected to. Each of the combined wells will be able to pump 500 gallons of water a minute or 720,000 gallons of water a day. We're at the Hickory Well Field and what we have behind us is the uh, electrical control building for well number six. This building contains the electrical controls, uh, instruments that tell us how much water is being pumped from this well and how much water is going into the ground storage tank. That tank is there because one of the nine existing wells is higher than the rest. It's about 90 feet in diameter and can hold half a million gallons of water. Well six is is typical of all of the wells on the well field except for the uh, existence of this ground storage tank. This electrical building controls the electricity that runs the well. There is a communication system with a tower that sends information back to St. Angelo, updating engineers on the status of the pipeline and the groundwater storage tank. It also relays data on well six, which is 2,570 feet deep. We collect the data about what's going on in the well, how, how much water the pump is pumping, what's the elevation of the water in the well, the elevation of the water in the storage tank. So if I push this button right here, water would move from well six into the groundwater storage tank. This is the first stage in the process of moving water from the Hickory Aquifer through the Hickory Pipeline to the city of San Angelo. The six new wells are expected to be online by March of next year. For Concha Valley Homepage News Connection, I'm Stephanie Garland.